birthday. Day 28, 29, but it's actually day 30. Magonia is 0 for 2 in his career against Houston Street. I skipped 28, 29. What do you guys think about that? Um, housekeeping. First of all, thank you to everyone that reached out to me and said a kind word or sent a kind message. I appreciate it. It's kind of going through something right now. It's just, I feel like I'm surrounded by a lot of negativity and that negativity and that bad juju energy just does not make me want to create. It does not make me want to do anything. It just makes me want to go in the hole. And that's what's going on. And a lot of times, if I'm having a bad moment or so in my life, I'll just be honest, I'll go to social media to kind of just find a chuckle or something. And usually maybe somebody will post a joke or something inspiring or something. And pretty much everywhere you go, it's just about not only the virus, which I can handle, and people's thoughts and everything, but it's the way people are treating each other. It just weighs incredibly heavy on me and I'm just having a hard time just dealing with the whole thing. So to combat that say, I decided I was going to do a bucket shot, so to speak. Something that I've always wanted to do and it just hasn't worked out. And I always come up with a whole bunch of different reasons why not to do it. It was the shot of me and Allison in the park. I've always wanted to do that. And it's still that maybe, you know, I'll play with it. I think we could improve on it. We weren't centered on the blanket and there's a whole bunch of things that I didn't exactly, but it's our first time at it. And I wanted the grass to be greener anyway. So, but it was a great first chance, first try. So Monday, I really didn't do a whole lot. Yesterday, I helped a friend out do some IT stuff. I got that straightened out. I did run, uh, Cabot Creek was open. So we went to Cabot Creek and while we were there, um, got to see the CCs, which was always like one of my they're the best people on the planet. So that was awesome. We went from there, I went to Neiman's to try to get some soup and some ramen and both were out. So that was a wasted trip, but the upside of that, you guys see my buddy Matt, as he was walking out, I was walking in. And then we decided, I was so frustrated, we decided well, let's go get Chinese and on our way to get Chinese food, I ended up seeing my son. And then I haven't seen my son in a long time. And I think that's another one of the things I'm dealing with is at least my oldest, you know, we worked together, I saw him every day almost. So it's just hard. My buddy Brad reached out and said, you shouldn't feel like you have to do anything. And I understand that, but and you know, for the, there's a group of people that will tell me how much they enjoy seeing this whole thing that we do. As much joy as we can put in the world, we need to do that now. Everyone needs to do that now. And I just think we all can do better across the board. So that's it. Well, shout out Polly Hunter on the signs from L White. Super cool. So that's kind of it. We're wrapping that up today. I'm going to get this out and edit it up so that way I can... One last thing that happened today. The TV finally went on the fritz. It's been slowly kind of err uh, and err uh, and err uh, and today I just finally called up Jason Young over at Young's and he was able to, uh, uh, there's still some appliances and he was able to send me a TV. Did a shot of that. Great service as always. I was able to message him. We had everything all set up. Walk into there, have it paid for, brought it out to me. We loaded and he helped, I helped him load the car, but he totally would have been on the way I went. So he said before I arrived there, he sanitized everything and including even the doors for me. So I don't think you can really ask anything more for anyone ever. So if you guys are looking for your TV, I got a great deal, great deal on the Samsung. So if you guys are looking for TV, Jason and Katie, all of them, they're awesome. So that's that. I'm gonna wrap it up, I'm rambling. I will talk to you guys tomorrow.